Okay, this is to show how to register the um, the OCX file required to uh, that Windows requires to select uh, your model files for the for your Trinitron monitor, and it's a little different with 64-bit uh, versions of Windows. Uh, I, th I know for sure this will work with Windows 7. Uh, I think it may actually. I think it may work with uh, Vista 64-bit also. So first, you need to, you need to get the uh, file, and this is the one right here. I think it stands for Microsoft Flex FlexGrid.ocx. I think that's what it stands for. And once you get a hold of this file, you need to copy it and paste it in this directory. You need to put it. You need to go to your computer, click on your local disk where your operating system is. Click on the wall, and then click on the Windows folder, and then scroll down to where it says SYS while 64. Click on that, and you drop the file in here. You know, so just a simple copy and paste. Once you have done that, you need to click Start, Run, and if you don't have the Run option, then on your keyboard you should have a Windows logo key. Uh, you need to hold that button down and press the R button at the same time, as I do on this keyboard, and it should bring up the window. So once this comes up, you need to type this command. So and you type it exactly as you see it. And if the name of your uh, file that you download is different, you need to make sure that it matches. Otherwise, it's not, it's not going to see the file. So once you have typed it, you click OK, and you should get a window that says it successfully uh, registered. It basically successfully uh, registered the file. Once done, click OK, and then open Windows, and you should be able to have everything set up. You know, you, you can click uh, Model Select, and it should bring up the model the model files. So, uh, after that, you should be good to go. So that's it.